Sino sa inyo ang may alam na may kakayahan silang to do things well? Pero madalas nagkaka-self-doubt. Ano kayang dahilan kung bakit nawawalan tayo ng kumpiyansa sa sarili? Narinig nyo na ba ang expression na be your own fan? Welcome back to Onboard Nanay. Sa mga bago pa lang sa channel na to, I'd like to introduce myself. My name is King and I upload videos every week that many Filipino women could relate to. Be your own fan. Ano to? This is an expression that shows self-encouragement, self-appreciation, and self-belief. Ibig sabihin, we have to embrace and celebrate ourselves, our accomplishments, and unique qualities even when other people don't recognize and praise you. Ito yung meron kang confidence sa mga abilities mo. Ito yung mga ina-acknowledge mo yung mga achievements mo. And you also support your own endeavors. Being your own fan means to not rely on external validation and approval from other people to feel good about yourself. Kung baga, supportahan mo yung sarili mo tulad ng pagsuporta mo sa mga paborito mong artista, sa mga at athletes or other or teams. Being your own fan doesn't mean you have to be arrogant ha, yung bang mayabang ka at hindi ka na tumatanggap ng criticism. But it should build self-esteem. This is the time you acknowledge your strengths and being kind to yourself when you are having self-doubt. Kasi dyan ka matutulungan na makapag-move forward, maging resilient and more motivated sa mga panahong na hihirapan kang iangat ang sarili mo. Here are some tips on how you can be your own fan. Celebrate your achievements. Maliit man yan or malaki, make sure you celebrate it and tap yourself in the back. You can keep a journal where you can write your accomplishments, positive experiences, and the things that you can be grateful for. Focus on your strengths and practice self-compassion. Ikaw lang ang nakakaalam kung saan ka magaling. Mag-focus ka doon and if ever naman you fail on something, be kind to yourself. Ibigay mo sa sarili mo yung same compassion and understanding that you can offer to a friend. Learn from your mistakes and look at it as opportunities for growth. Before I move on, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video if you're finding value in this. I will be very, very grateful po sa inyo. Thank you so much. Next, learn to accept compliments. Di pa madami sa mga Filipinos, kapag kinocompliment, laging di na downplay yung situation. Yung bang pag sinabihan ng, Uy, yung galing-galing mo naman, ang sagot, di naman, tsamba lang. Na dapat sana ang sagot, salamat kasi I worked hard for it. Accept compliments graciously. Practice positive self-talk and surround yourself with positivity. Challenge negative thoughts and replace them with positive affirmations. Paalala mo sa sarili mo yung capabilities and worth mo. On top of this, you should surround yourself with people who support you and will uplift you. Umiwas ka sa mga taong who will bring you down or dun sa mga taong lagi kang kinikriticize. Visualize success. Malaking tulong sa sarili mo kung nakikita mo yung sarili mo na nagiging successful sa mga goals mo. It helps you build confidence and motivation. I remember to learn isa kong co-worker when I was still working. She would put post-its in front of her table and write down the rewards for herself kung ma-achieve niya yung mga goals niya. And most of the time, she was our top performing employee sa office. Shout out to you, Mama Cor, I miss you. Set boundaries. Kailangan you know how to say no sa mga bagay that would just drain your energy. Prioritize relationships and activities that will nourish your self-esteem. Be yourself. You need to embrace your authentic self. Stop comparing yourself to others kasi iba-iba tayo ng journey. Hindi mo kailangan mag-conform sa standards ng iba. Take care of yourself. Get enough rest, eat properly, and find activities that give you joy. That way, you enjoy life to the fullest. Remember that being your own fan is an ongoing process. This needs self-awareness and practice. You won't be able to do it overnight. If you have the willingness to do it, you are well on your way. Treat yourself with the same love and admiration you would show to someone you deeply care about. In time, you will build a stronger and more positive relationship with yourself. Thank you so much for watching me today. I hope you got something from my video. Always be blessed. Keep on learning because there is no stopping you. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Bye!